now for Fins on Four, and it's the night before the start of training camp, but some of our attention is focused on the upcoming Hall of Fame ceremony. Beloved Miami Dolphin Jason Taylor will be inducted a week from Saturday. CBS4 sports anchor Jim Barry back with us. He has JT's thoughts on what's to come over the next 10 days. Hi, Jim. Hey, guys. going to be exciting. You know, Jason Taylor's head has been swimming now for months. Now his Hall of Fame moment is nearly here. Next week, JT will be enshrined as a football immortal with friends, family, and former teammates present. The glib Taylor admits he was first rendered speechless when he got this news. Taylor, one of seven new yeah, Hall of Fame inductees, will become the 10th Dolphin in the Hall. He'll join legends like Dan Moreno, who will lead a contingent of former Dolphins, who's going to be in Canton for Taylor's induction. Jimmy Johnson, the coach who drafted JT, will introduce the player whom he called a true dynamic game changer. And that bust is a pretty good likeness, isn't it? During his dynamic Dolphin days, Taylor says all he thought about was making plays. It was never the goal. It was never something I was shooting for and, and focusing on. It was it was just a product of you know, trying to put good seasons together back to back and and trying to be the best player I could be. So there, there was never a real concerted focus on it. It always it was always kind of in the periphery and you know, until we retire and you look back and say, Hey, maybe here's a shot. Then and meanwhile, the current Dolphins today stream into team headquarters. Mike Pouncey, Dominic, and Sue, they all know what time it is. Training camp officially begins bright and early in the morning. Most of the big names will hit the field, save for Pouncey, who's taken slow, and also safe for Rashad Jones, who's sidelined for unknown reasons. As the Finns sweat it out, we're going to crank up our coverage. Join us for the season premiere of Camp Dolphins. Our nightly wrap-up of Finns training camp begins tomorrow night right after the late news. As for Mr. Jason Taylor, he'll talk more about his upcoming Hall of Fame glory at camp tomorrow. Taylor not only expects former Finns in Canton, but also 100 of his former college teammates from the University of Akron nearby. So it's going to be very exciting for him. He said they're going to start partying on Saturday night on into Sunday. <laughs> You're going to be there too, right? I am. I'm really looking forward to it because it's certainly going to be a special moment for Jason Taylor and seeing uh, so many of his former teammates there, I think is really going to make the day really special for him uh, and uh, us. It's going to bring back a lot of memories for me and I'm going to get some of the backstories of some of those big plays that Jason Taylor made. Good. Well, we'll look forward to uh, hearing your thoughts after attending that great event. Thanks, Jim. Yeah. Thanks, Jim. Well, CBS4 is your official Miami Dolphin station. We'll have extensive coverage of the start of training camp. Look for live reports beginning at 5 a.m. tomorrow on CBS4 News.